Greetings, sirs and madams. I'm Seraphic Zero, and we're playing Gundam Battle Operation 2. So here I have the Hambrabi, and this match is actually from my first day of using the Hambrabi. And the very match before this, I had a really bad time and lost 3,000 to 20,000. But yeah, let's see if we can uh, violate the enemy and turn this around a little bit. So yeah, the, the Hambrabi is a, well, a high cost raid type, and it's uh, it's a very bizarre looking transforming mobile suit from Zeta Gundam. And uh, yeah, it it's, looks really weird, and but like the toolkit is really interesting and fun, and overall the suit's just really fun to use. Um, the Hamrabi happens to have the best mobile armor mode of all the transforming suits so far. Yeah, it uh, it does the highest ramming damage, and its ranged guns are the absolute best. It has these double beam guns that rapid fire and stun, and they just do crazy damage. Yeah, so I spotted some support suits, so let's see if I can uh, hurt them here. Oh jeez, yeah, so the, the enemy team spotted me pretty fast, but... Yeah, I uh, did a lot of damage to that Sturm Dias in a short amount of time. Yeah, so, yeah, I know I'm not going to survive this. I'm pretty much just doing this to break their formation. And, um, yeah, I, th I think I did an okay job of um, distracting about half of their team. So that um, pretty much worked out how I planned. Yeah, so um, my team has a very weird balance. Um, we have, like, one raid, which is me, and then five generals. Uh, this is not so uncommon in these higher costs. Uh, yeah, because uh, supports, they kind of have a little bit of trouble uh, with mobility at this cost range, so yeah. Um, <clears throat> okay, so I am alone with this Hamahama in uh, the caves. I'm waiting for my my Fedayeen beam rifle to uh, cool down. Yeah, it does okay, like, range damage, so yeah, I just used the maneuver armor to bait out the charge shot from him. So for me, that was a really good trade. I just took a little bit of damage, I didn't get stunned, and I managed to land a finishing shot on him, so yeah, that worked out pretty well. Okay, so we're using the mobile armor mode to catch up with our allies. Yeah, the guy I was planning to shoot is already dead, so I guess we'll turn around and see who this is. Um, pretty zippy, who is this? Yeah, I think it's actually the Sturm Dias. Okay, so I'm going to use Maneuver Armor to bait out his stun. Okay, that worked out pretty well. Okay, so here's kind of the one instance I managed to use the Hambrabi's combo. And, um, <clears throat> yeah, so I got pretty much all the hits in that I wanted, but, yeah, I accidentally stunned our Kubli, so, <laughs> like, uh, that kind of made me hesitate with the final cancel. So, yeah, I kind of messed up a little bit, but, yeah, I did manage to, um, finish off the Sturm Dias, so it worked out pretty okay. Okay, so we have them push back. They're uh, escaping by uh, trying to flank us. Um, I don't really want to fight that double Zeta. It's a, it's a little hard for Hambrabis to fight them. Okay, let's get over here. I saw a support type over here. I'm not sure who it was. Uh, that's a Hama Hama. Okay, so I can do okay damage to it at range, but, but yeah, the, the Hambrabi, it doesn't really have good shooting correction. So the Fedeen Beam Rifle, it's really just, it's just there for um, setting up stuns, maybe a little bit of tick damage. Yeah, we're going to use the mobile armor mode to close distance, so I managed to stun the Kublai and follow up with the Ram. Yeah, so I did pretty okay. Yeah, I, I don't know if we, yeah, that wasn't quite a good trade in damage, though. I, I got pretty hurt from that. Okay, let's see if we can help these guys. Who's that? Yeah, that's the double Zeta and then uh, the Tetra. Okay, let's see if we can hit the Tetra once he... What the... Did it... Did that little asshole just teleport out of the way? Let's look at this again. You motherfucker. Oh, that's so annoying. Uh, okay. Let's see. Ah. Getting shot at, like, from two angles here. Okay, so we hit each other at the same time, and... Yeah, this this guy's really uh, lagging here. That, man, that is really annoying. Kind of, like, I kind of yearn for the day of to see what this game would be like without lag. I don't even know if it's technically possible, but... Okay, so there goes my first spawn. I survived for a long time. Or actually, that's not my first spawn, because I died really quick at the beginning of the match. I forgot about that. Okay, so, yeah, so ace mode. Uh, yeah, we're playing ace mode. The aces were declared, so the enemy ace is the Tetra, which we just took out. 
And of course, uh, our Kublai is our ace, so yeah, Kublais are actually very good at uh, playing the ace role, because like, they just have like so many different kinds of ranged weapons to do damage with. Okay, got a few hits on, on this Kublai, and okay, it looks like the Sturm Dias, so I, can, I will set him up with the Sea Serpent. And I think a double Zeta is swinging at me from behind. Oof. Yeah, I'm not really sure why he would want to swing at me instead of uh, attacking the ace or something like that. Yeah, so we have him surrounded, and I'm just using my neutral combos to try to keep him locked down. Yeah, so that, that uh, worked out pretty well, and uh, the ace managed to get the killing blow on him, so yeah, that pretty much worked out perfectly. Okay, so I think at this point we managed to get a, a team wipe for the enemy team, so we're just going to use the opening to heal up our ace a little bit. Yeah, I got him to about 90%. And we're just going to hop back in because I think the enemy's uh, back on our heads again. Okay, so we have some people in the distance. I'm not sure who that is. I think it might be the Sturm Dias because I think I can see his uh, really long cannons over his head, yeah. Okay, so I think he's by himself now. So I'm going to close distance and pretty much just finish him off. Yeah, it's... Uh, yeah, when there are transforming ray types around, you do not want to stand by yourself because you're gonna, yeah, you're, you're gonna have no help. Oof, yeah, how did I hit him? Like, I think uh, my downswing actually caught the tip of his cannons. That was really unlucky for him. Okay, and <laughs> the enemy is just gonna flew into me like that was a freebie. Okay, so we have this Kubli surrounded. Okay, let me try. Oof. Is he just me, or like, did I only get damage off of one swing? That looked pretty weird. Ugh, okay, I'm really damaged. Like, that double Zeta really likes hitting me from behind. Okay, he is after our Kubli. Let's see if we can protect them. Mmm, get Steve Irwin. <laughs> Sorry, was that too early? Okay, got the kill on that. Wow, he got violated pretty bad. <clears throat> but yeah, we, we love you, Steve. Yeah. Okay, um... Yeah, somebody just shot me in my cone head. I'm like, what the hell was that? Okay, running out of time. I'm trying to stay a little bit behind cover because yeah, there's no, there's no need to die at the last second for no reason. Okay, so yeah, that's the clock, and I think here the game actually started lagging a bit, so it's taking a bit of time to bring up the score. Okay, so our team took the win despite our really weird team makeup. Let's see how we did on the score. Oh uh, yeah, <laughs> the enemy team got violated pretty bad. Um, yeah, that was yeah like a 12,000 point lead. Like that's uh, pretty impressive. Yeah, so our ace uh, got the highest score. Uh, I happened to do the most damage somehow. Um, given the team balances, I think the enemy team technically has type advantage, uh, but they don't really have a lot of stopping power. So I think that's kind of why we overtook them. Yeah, so, yeah, that was a, a really fun match. I think I managed to redeem myself from my uh, horrible, horrible <laughs> loss earlier. But, uh, but yeah, the, I haven't gotten to use the Hamrabi in a lot of matches, but it's very fun to use. Um, a little challenging, and it does die really fast, but, yeah, overall, I think it's really fantastic. Um, so, yeah, hopefully there are a lot more transforming suits that are like this. I'm still waiting to... Uh, get a transforming support type, but but yeah, the Hambravi is fantastic. I really love its counter and how it uses uh, its transforming parts. But alright guys, that's going to be it for the video. Hopefully you enjoyed it, and we'll see you next time.